Okay, so I have to figure this out. Damn it. Where is which way? They're following me, so I gotta figure out which which way. I've seen some stuff on Google. There's supposed to be. Pretty sure quite taking taking care of them, which is good. But I don't see. Get him! get a uh, supply drop weapon rocket please hold supplies requested why aren't you shooting what the hell oh they're fighting each other shit Come on, give me that supply drop, damn it, before they kill him. Rocket, got my rocket, shit. Run, 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 run. Gotta keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. Alright, give me that, give me that rocket, give me that rocket. Wait, where are they at? Reload, reload, reload. Where are you at? Reload, reload, reload. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Where are you at, bro? Reload. I need supplies. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, I'm gonna need supplies. Need supplies, supplies, supply drop. Please, supplies requested. Fuck man, come on. Come on. Shit. No more ammo. Come on. Reload, 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 reload. Reload, 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 reload. Reload, come on. That mist is clearing. All right. Word, boss. Helicopter. Coming in on another chopper. Get code talker to the LZ and wait there. Can't get it. Shit. Okay. Alright, come on, buddy. Good job, Quiet. Good job. We did it. 
But look at all, all this fucking material I, c I could use. Hang on. Let me get this shit. Can I get this? Yes, I can. Come on, let me get this. Get this shit. Come on. Come on. Come on, let me get that. One more. One more. One more. Get down here. Get down here. Get in, boss. What? Extraction arrived at mother base. Development. Parasite suit. Mission complete. I know we can do better next time. Yeah, it was fucking chicken hat. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. Come on, old man. Skullface is no longer in Africa. The nuclear test was a success. Now they turned the knives on me. Satellites didn't read any test. Neither did seismometers. The detonation test took place five years ago in the southern Indian Ocean. The final test was the opposite, to prevent detonation. You mean? Skullface plans to sell nuclear weapons that he retains control of. It's not like hawking small arms to militias. Indeed. He plans to avoid detection. We're exporting minerals containing tiny amounts of uranium in the form of metallic archaea. Once on site, the metallic archaea enrich the uranium and weaponize it, loaded onto all-terrain bipedal machines. They ensure any country, armed group, even the smallest terrorist cell can become a nuclear power. Bipedal. So that's why they needed Huey. A new business to replace the arms business. And Skullface owns the market. The very atmosphere of nukes. Anywhere and everywhere. Deterrence on all sides. So that's why he ran a non-detonation test. Yes. Another metallic archaea instantly overrides the criticality generator. Fail safe only he controls. Any such weapon can be deactivated whenever he chooses, regardless of who owns it or their intent to use it. Snooks. Controlled by a man, not a country. If they proliferate, conventional nukes lose all value. Political, military, and economic. The two superpowers. Powerless. <laughs> the R&D and medical teams have come up with a proposal for a new suit that applies Code Talker's research. The Parasite Suit. Mm -hmm. Apparently it can recreate some of the Skull's unusual abilities. Mm. But in order to use those abilities, it needs parasites. Mm. If you want to wear this suit, you're gonna need to get a hold of parasites by extracting skulls. Oh, okay. We 
need to stop the epidemic at Mother Base. About the pathogen spreading through Mother Base, what's your opinion? Textbook symptoms of vocal cord parasite infestation. And judging from this casualty list, it is the Kikongo strain. Meaning, a breed of parasite that triggers symptoms upon detecting pronunciation specific to Kikongo. So how do we keep them from becoming symptomatic? Use this. Holy shit, that's a lot of bodies. Type of Wolpachia. Introduced to a sample of the parasite. The parasitic bacteria that colonizes the parasites. Turning male to female. And preventing copulation. You must cultivate more. Thanks to Code Talker, we've managed to put a stop to any new vocal cord parasite infections. We couldn't save those already symptomatic, but everyone who survived has been released from the quarantine platform. Skullface will pay for this. Huh. Come on, loading screen. Come on, loading screen. Again with a truth serum. What are those legs made of? Titanium? All the way to the femur. <laughs> Metallic Archaea. Sohilanthropus. Where is it? What? We have to know before his plan is complete. Sir Helanthropus is the final piece. W w what are you talking about? If the Soviets break out a mobile, controllable nuclear weapon... East-West relations will be right back at the Cuban Missile Crisis. The Cold War returns to life as countries without nuclear arsenals line up for what skull faces sell. Nuclear weapons proliferate overnight, and on the brink of annihilation, the world maintains its balance. But we know this is all just a shield, a ruse. The cleansing parasites are what matter most. A WMD to eclipse even nukes, and the only one that can still be used. Skullface is the world's greatest threat. And zeroes. The pieces are in place. All that remains is to unveil Sohilanthropus in Afghanistan. They can't activate it without me. Oh shit. Ugh. <sighs> 
gonna do it. Okay, B Zero. The philanthropist is beyond the Soviet base camp in a lab built by the Soviet philosophers. That's what you're looking for. But I have no idea how he's controlling it. It wasn't designed to accommodate a human pilot. Oh, got word from Afghanistan. Everyone at the Soviet base camp's dead. No sign of fighting. Parasites. Oh shit. Skull faces men then headed north. The target is OKB Zero. That's where he'll activate Sahalanthropus. Unless we stop him, he'll go down in history a conquering victor. We can't let that happen. Wipe him out. Don't leave any trace of his existence. I'm gonna need backup on this one. You'll rendezvous on site. Alright, so I'm gonna upgrade my rocket launchers, my whatever stuff I need. Continued, of course. Since it's an episodic thing. All right, let's see. I don't give a fuck. Mission list updated. Reward scheme, that shit. I don't. Yeah, whatever. MVP. Weapons. Uh, specify a project. Rockets, 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 rock, rockets. That doesn't do a lot of. But it does do a lot of damage. Killer B. Mm. Thirty-six minutes. What the fuck? Are you really? S are you shitting me? Uh, I need. Bolts on children. Damn it. Okay, okay. Don't have enough. Uh, what else can I up upgrade? Body equipment. Please specify a project. Guilty butterfly. Make it. I guess just guilty. Send for. Oh, that's already done. So. I need Brennan R. Blueprint. Shit. Yeah, we'll do that. I want an hour and 12 minutes. Holy fuck. Security devices. Please specify a project. Oh, interesting. Map. You got missions. Combat deployment. Let's see. Please select a mission. Unit dispatched. Unit dispatched. Unit dispatched. 
Unit dispatched. Gazette tapes. Is it about the pathogen spreading through Mother Base? You've seen everything we've got on the outbreak. What's your opinion? Textbook symptoms of vocal cord parasite infestation. And judging from this casualty list, it is the Kikongo strain. Oh, I already heard this one. Now we must wait for the Volbachia to multiply in the larvae. How is the disease transmitted? If it's carried by insects or rodents, then... There is no intermediate host. So... The vocal cord parasites lay their eggs in the larynx of the host. Most hatch and migrate to the lungs. But some are transported to the mouth through ciliary movement. Mixing in with saliva. Saliva. Droplet transmission. Sneezing, coughing, any food or water containing infected saliva, it would spread fast. Indeed, and when the larvae migrate to the lungs, symptoms can resemble the early stages of a cold, making it easy to infect others. Meaning a simple conversation would be enough to pass it on. All right, so what happens after the larvae migrate to the lungs? It is as I said before. They mature by feeding on alveolar tissue. It is only then that noticeable symptoms appear in the host. And by that point, it's too late. He's infected everyone else. It's one hell of a weapon you've created. That is what Blag Anna wanted. Something that would spread easily. In truth, He's not the reason. But we will discuss that another time. Huh. Go, Docker. What are the metallic archaea? Volcanic craters spewing sulfur. Water hot enough to boil your skin off. Ocean depths of 800 plus atmospheres. Wastelands radioactive enough to kill you where you stand. <sighs> there are groups of organisms that survive this fight. No, because of living in such environments. I've heard about them. Extremo something. Extremophiles. By selecting certain species, then subculturing and repeatedly modifying them. I created a metallic offspring of pure archaea. They subsist on metals rather than organic matter. And some of them even consume uranium? Yes. Uranium enrichment archaea metabolize only uranium-235. As a result, they produce weapons-grade enriched uranium. How is that possible? Consider how plants fractionate carbon isotopes when they conduct photosynthesis. Nature possesses abilities beyond our imagination. So it was Archaea that brought down your chopper? Corrosive Archaea, yes. They oxidize metals, feeding off the energy in the electrons they receive. What became of the wreckage? We had the R&D team retrieve samples for study and... Uh... Airtight plastic containers, of course. Prudent. We shall extract our chaos from it in good time. They should help you fight back against Black Anna. Any chance we could start now? It doesn't have to be a lot. I might just have another use for them. If it's only a small amount you need. That's fine. I'll get the R&D team to assist. Let's go. All right, skull South face. Africa was pre Thanks to Code Talker, we've managed to put a stop to any new vocal cord parasite infections. We couldn't save those already symptomatic. 
but everyone who survived has been released from the quarantine platform. Mm -hmm. Skullface will pay for this. Boss, Emmerich confessed. Skullface's endgame is to activate the bipedal walking tank Sahelanthropus and deploy it into live combat in Afghanistan. That's why he moved into the Soviet research facility they call OKB-0. If his plan comes to fruition, there'll be no stopping the ripple effect worldwide. Find a way to make contact with Skullface before that happens. Then learn what you can from him and put a stop to his plan. We'll have our fun with him later. This is it, boss. Diamond Dogs is strong enough now to face him head to head. It won't be like nine years ago. Make your way to OKB Zero. Alright, I'm on it. Accept it. Accept the mission. I'm gonna need a secondary weapon. No, fuck. Primary. Probably a rocket launcher. Body quiet. We can butterfly. Yeah. Cool face. Yep. Exactly. Let's go. Let's do this. 